Boom. So just here's where we put the kitchen scrap. We build it into a compost bin with about 600 pounds of green scraps and we layer it with straw. And it starts off this high and it'll drop down to, uh, this one's about yay high. This one over here, it's only a foot high now. And at this point, we're gonna try to harvest some of these, some of the, the soil that's in the middle of it. This is a compost pile that's been sitting here for about six months. It's compost that we've made over here and we've compiled it into this. And we wanna look and see what kind of material we have. And by digging, and you can see this is actually very nice. This is the stuff we're looking for. Yes, we're cleaning up this compost. We're trying to get the good stuff, the small particles, and then pull out any larger uh, pieces of straw or bark or cork that we've put in here. This is all good stuff. Let me get a container and we'll use it in our next compost batch. And you can just keep piling it up. <laughs> Perfect, so we start start with a layer of just brown material, so leaves are the best. Straw is okay, What? that's the leaves that we brought out of the other one. Anything else that's brown, like what is this thing? This is one of those uh, little wheatgrass patches. So this is green material, which is uh, food scraps from Red Rabbit, in this case. A lot of leaf, leafy greens, onions, what else, apples, 